you're supposed to be visible. You might not see anything, but you go hunting, like bounty hunting for an arrest. Locking up some, some old guy, some homeless guy, finding somebody who's riding a bicycle on the sidewalk, who's spitting, and you bring him in. The problem is when you go hunting, when you put any type of numbers on a police officer to perform, we are going to go to the most vulnerable. The most vulnerable. Of course. We're going to go to LGBT community. We're going to go to the black community. We're going to go to those people that have no vote, that have no power. If we start doing what we're doing in midtown Manhattan, a phone call to the mayor's office is going to be made. That's going to be the end of it. We're the predators, they're the prey. The worst thing you can have is a police officer that needs an arrest for the month. So you're all minorities. How does that make you feel? It's, it's horrible. This is something coming from the top that trickles its way down, and this is why we're all here today. We first interviewed Officer Edwin Raymond last month. He says he's been recording conversations with NYPD officials for the past two years in an effort to prove alleged quotas and retaliation against cops who don't rack up numbers. They are breaking the law. Raymond's claims elicited this expletive from the police commissioner. Is it bullshit is my response to that. The commissioner insists his policies are focused on the quality of arrests and summonses, not the quantity. The officer's attorney. Is the commissioner lying? Yes. Commissioner Bratton is lying. How can you prove this? I can prove it with testimony, with recordings, with documents. All he wants us to do is go out there and lock them up. They told us it's, 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 it's easy to get numbers out here because you, you work in this type of community. Are you arresting for stuff that you shouldn't be arresting for? Well, that's why we're here. We don't do it. We refuse. And because of that, we are retaliated against. Because you're not harassing people, you're being punished. You know? And it, it doesn't make for a great work environment because they want you to harass people. The lawsuit claims minority officers are punished more severely than white cops for failing to meet quotas. The city denies it. And the community are suffering the most. Because? Because the pressure, because the quota. Because the police department is like a whore pretending to be a lady. That's what they are. Are you worried? You know, this is a big step to come forward like this. It's not easy. It's not easy. Um, we are the enemies. We are the people that nobody talked to. The culture of the department, we are the rats. That's how they call us. They are, we are the rats that speak out. It takes a lot of guts from a rat to stand where we stand, knowing that our career are basically over the second we speak against such a mafia. Because the police department is a mafia. It's a, it's a big organized mafia. Again, the police commissioner declined to go on camera to address the allegations. The city has asked a judge to dismiss portions of the lawsuit, claiming the officers haven't begun to prove a case either for quotas or racial discrimination. We will have much more on the story at 11, including what the cops say happens when they...